welcome back to the channel. Today is part one of our Financial Freedom Boot Camp and I'm really excited. It is a 12 step program that I'm doing. I'm going to be doing one video a month and one challenge a month that we're going to focus on for that whole month um, to become financially free. And I'm excited. I'm going to do it and I hope you're going to do it with me and I'm going to show you all the steps to get there. So the first part is learning how to budget. And as easy as a sheet of paper, you can have a clipboard, you can have a folder um, with the name budget on it. It does not have to be complicated. I want something where it's one account, one sheet of paper, and it's all easy in here. So this is the sheet that I have, and everyone's going to be a little bit different. And so I'm going to show you the basics. I'm also going to put a... Um, link below so that you can have something like this to download that I've created. Um, but on top we're going to have the month, January, and then you're going to have the challenge for that month. Um, and then you're going to put in your checking, and the next you're going to do bills, um, and everything that goes out, the necessities, uh, food, clothing, and shelter are going to come first. And then you're going to do like, um, your subscriptions and other extra fluff that we have. And um, one of the months that we're going to do is we're going to be looking to our subscriptions and seeing which ones we really don't use or need. So that's one of the challenges for one of our months coming up. Um, and then savings um, at the bottom, and then you're going to put your total at the end. Now, um, for food, you're going to have yourself a food budget. And um, so let's say you have $500 in food budget and you go shopping for $128 and then you have a total of $372. So you're going to use the back of your sheet to keep track of the food for the month so you're not overspending on food. And one of the months we are also going to be doing a pantry challenge, no eating out challenge. And it's going to be really fun. I'm going to show you some new recipes and some tips and tricks that I do to help not overspend because some I know as a mom I get in such a rush so I'm like okay it's just it's been a long day let's just eat out but I'm going to show you some tips on how to make it happen so I'm really excited now let's go to this month's challenge this month's challenge is all about being energy efficient and it is easy is screwing or unscrewing a light bulb um so Every time I move into a house, I look around and I change all my light bulbs to LED light bulbs. I also, instead of having, let's say, four light bulbs in the bathroom, I plug in two or three. That saves on energy in itself. Another thing that you can do is, if you're not using it, keep it unplugged. That's just energy um, wasted when it's plugged in and not even being used. Another thing is use natural light. During the day, open those curtains, pull up those blinds, and use that natural light to light your house. Don't have excess lights on. Um, teach your kids that when they leave a room, turn the light off. You can't believe how many times I go into the back bedroom and there's the bathroom lights, the kids' room's lights on, and so we are working on teaching them that when you leave a room, turn off the light. And then last but not least, the challenge for this month is to do either a TV-free morning or a TV-free night, at least two to three times a week. Not only will that help you um, get things done around your house, but it will also save you on energy. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe below so you don't miss out on any other challenges and updates. Okay, we'll see you later. Bye!